For many practitioners of martial arts, becoming an instructor is a dream career. However, teaching martial arts is not the best paid profession in the world, but is both fun and fulfilling. It should be noted that some instructors earn a lot more money than others. For example, in the USA, the grappling sports of wrestling and Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu are by far the best paid. This is because Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu is fairly new and an in-demand sport which does not have as many elite level coaches when compared to striking arts. Wrestling is a culturally loved sport with many colleges and high schools interested in hiring the best wrestling coaches and athletes. On the other hand, sports such as Muay Thai and Judo are overlooked a little within America. It's still possible to earn money in both of these sports, but still nowhere near as much as BJJ or wrestling. For example, if a wrestling coach was earning $55,000 per year, we would expect a Muay Thai instructor to earn less than $40,000. In other parts of the world, this is the other way around. Muay Thai coaches in Thailand can earn a decent living from training foreign tourists whilst visiting the country. There is no real demand for wrestlers in this part of the world. To summarise, different skills are valued differently depending on which country you live in. Depending on your location, you can definitely make a living teaching martial arts, but it's going to be difficult to make a killing. The key takeaway from this is that if you want to make the most money, then you're going to have to own the business. If you're paid by someone else to teach martial arts in their school, you should not expect to be well paid. Even full-time instructors will struggle to make more than $40,000 per year if they don't own the academy. If you live in a small town, it's almost impossible to make a living as a martial arts instructor unless you own the school. However, if you do own a martial arts school, then you can make significantly more money as well as scale up. At this point, you aren't just being paid for your time, which is another key point, since martial arts classes do not run from 9 to 5 each day and are a lot more sporadic. In short, you can make a living teaching martial arts, but it certainly isn't well paid. Most people who do this job do it because they love it or also have another part-time job. To make a good amount of money without your own school is very difficult. Another main source of income within martial arts is one-to-one -one instruction. The only way to do this efficiently is to become an expert in a particular field and then teach private lessons. This process has been shown to work across several different martial arts including Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, Muay Thai and even high level Judo. If you are a well respected coach who has worked with top level athletes you will likely be able to charge at the very least $50 per hour. If you live in a city like New York or San Francisco, this number should easily double to $100. Not only this, but having students come and train privately increases the number of hours you can work as a martial arts teacher. You no longer have to rely on the hours of 6 to 9 p.m. on weekdays and 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. on weekends this being the main drawback of being a martial arts instructor in general. As mentioned, the only other real way to make money is to make your own school and expand it around the local area. Many martial arts schools have done this relatively successfully and you will often find schools that have three or four branches. Whilst it's somewhat unlikely that the second and third schools will earn as much as the first, they can still bring in a good income and potentially be sold for more money in the future. There are a small variety of ways martial artists can make money, some of which are limited to first movers within each specific art. The first method is to write a book about the martial art which you have expertise in. This is not as lucrative as it once was, as book sales are nowhere near their peak. A more modern way of making money as a martial artist is to release an instructional video Whilst you cannot compete with free videos on YouTube, if you teach something to a high level which has not been shown before, people will pay money to see it. 
This is a particular trend within the grappling martial arts and has began to spill over into the striking arts. The only other ways are to open an academy. So, if you are thinking of becoming a martial arts instructor, you should probably have a business plan in place. This is not a lucrative career and requires lots of skill, energy and time.